wave. I'm in it for keepsake, in the field with the cleat lace. What is up, guys? Carlos and Kicks here, back with another one for you. I am so excited for this one. I, I can't even explain it. Uh, let, let's, let's just get the box out. So, boom. Here it is, the box. And uh, as you can tell from the description, and probably from the box, we have the Concepts and Nike SB Turduncans. Hopefully y'all can see me right here. Uh, gonna be a little close call because the cameras are really tight. Uh, but man, I I'm excited for these. So uh, these dropped on November 14th, um, just a few days ago. This specific one, their special package, special boxing, was exclusive to Concepts website. <sighs> Great job, Concepts on the, the drop, on everything, but the drop specifically. You don't really see a lot of brands or companies doing what Concepts and other ones have done it. They're not the first ones to do this, um, but really trying to really trying to help the manual gang out. Uh, so on their website, on the release, it asked you to ask you a question. And the question was, how do you spell Turduncan? And it said it right there. So I, and I didn't know if it was case sensitive or not because it, it asked it in all caps from what I remember. Um, I just literally copied and pasted it to try to get as quick as I could. And it let me right through and I checked out and I was shocked. But those type of little questions, those type of little things really help out when you're trying to get things manually. Bots, even that little, little split second uh, difference really helps, you know, for manual gang. Uh, Union did that for their drop. Uh, I think they said... How do you spell orange? Something like that. Something with orange. Uh, I remember the answer being orange when I got the guavas. But those type of things, you know, that's awesome. You don't see a lot of companies doing that or really even giving a crap to do that because either way, they're getting paid. So really, what does it matter to them? They don't care about resale value. You know, they're not caring whether it's going in the hands of someone who's putting them on feet or someone who's going to resell them. Either way, they're getting paid, which you got to respect, but also you got to look out for your consumers anyways. Uh, thank you concepts for doing that. And, uh, just that little bit of extra little half a second helped me out and helped a lot of other people help out. Um, I was watching the live stream on Roscoe's channel and, uh, a lot of people were getting through. Uh, if you're able to get through, let me know if you did it in all caps or not all caps. I think that was holding some people up. Uh, I again, just copied and pasted it and it worked and here we are, but enough of that. Let's, uh, let's get into what you're all here for. So starting with the box, uh, the box, and I'm gonna to try to switch to the uh, up top camera here. The box just says concepts, oven on fire, roast your friends in front of their friends, 28 and three, you can, cold cereal, I think, who's spider to a banana. I don't even know what this stuff even means to be honest with you, but I think it's really cool that they made this look like an oven is being shipped, <laughs> you know, because they could have shipped it in another box, but they really took thought into what are we gonna ship this in? Let's make that part of what's going out and part of the entire concept, you know? Uh, no pun intended, I'm gonna say concept a million times and I don't mean concepts, I just mean the idea of a concept. Let's bust these open. Whoa. <sighs> Damn, that's hella cool. And so just opening the box right away, if you can see it, it has smoke, flames, and it has the size range that they did there with the 11.5 circled when I went with. Thought that's cool. Oh. Boom. Let's get that one out of here. Man, and it just says concepts, color, rattan, baroque brown, parachute beige, orange chalk, frost. Really hope y'all can see that. Right on the front. Not the front. Hey, that's the bottom. Well, I don't know. I can't open it up. Here's the uh, the grill handle. So I'm guessing this is how you open it. Let's take a look here and find out. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Damn, that's so awesome. Right out of the... Uh, I'm just going to move this stuff out of the way here for you guys because so we can actually get into the box. Uh, right, first thing out of the box is this. So it's cool. It's also like a little Hasbro collab that they did. Turkey Vortex, you got mashed potatoes, corn. What the hell is that? Little cobbler, 
Uh, and they gave you a Nerf football, which is a turkey leg, turkey vortex dinner. Nerf concepts. Dude, that's so awesome. You're hanging out. Little, little turkey for dinner. Tur turducken for dinner. Put a little football outside. I mean, this is this is the full Thanksgiving package right here. On the back, serving size one, concepts and Nerf, Vortex, Arrow, Howler, Football. We outside, 100%. Active play, 100%. Skate, 100%. That's really cool. Little fun facts I have on the back. It's this kind of stuff that just makes concepts one of my favorite, if not the best, when it comes to their Nike SB collabs, in, in my opinion, right? They've had, I've always been a huge fan of, of all of the SB Concepts collab shoes that came out. Um, and they really could have easily gone the lobster way, right? They could have given us another colorway of the lobster SB Dunks. And I would have loved them. I love the lobsters, every other colors. People would have eaten them up, would have gone for them just as hard as they went for these, but they did it. They really went and thought outside the box and came up with some crazy random idea. Well, in my words of, you know, having dinner with your fam and playing football. And they just went hard with it, especially with the box, like an oven. That's just crazy. These had a retail price for the special box of $250. Uh, there's still time for the regular box packaging pair to come out. Those are gonna come out on November 23rd. Those will have a retail price of $120. A bunch of skate shops and of course the sneakers app will have those again on november 23rd for a retail of 120 bucks yeah 120 for the highs but let's get back on all the the goodies that are in here i'm gonna put this just right back there for now all right so next thing we have in here is super cool it's the paper which is a turkey that just says concepts that's awesome all right, let's get into the real star of the show here. The kicks. Man, this box is so cool. Let me just show that off one more time. It's just literally like the inside of an oven. Boom. So again, 11.5 Nike SB. With SBs, lows and highs, I go up a half size. Non-SBs, I go true to size and it works out for me. So, first thing we have, some socks. Looks like a turkey leg, says concepts sewn in right here. You got the little turkey feet at the bottom. Nike Everyday Max Lightweight Crew. That's awesome. We have the extra pair of laces, which look like cranberry sauce, cranberry colored laces. It's pretty dope. I thought they came with another color also but maybe i'm wrong let me just take a look here these are so dope Miss Fit got a quick lit on a crash course from the tattered garment to the tabloid fuck how i live it into existence i'd be ahead of myself but the bank account did jump up a couple feet. so we also have yellow laces and i'm so excited for those those are like sick on here so in case you couldn't tell already the entire concept behind this shoe was a turducken uh, which is a chicken stuffed into a duck stuffed into a turkey. I, I mean, that that's not, I don't know if that's for me, but if you've had it and you liked it, please let me know. Cause that, I'll try anything once, but that just sounds horrible. Uh, it's just, just a bunch of dry ass meat stuffed inside dry ass meat, stuffed inside dry ass meat. All that stuffed into each other's ass? No. Why? Who, who thought of that? Man, I don't know. If you've had it and it's good, please let me know down below because that does not sound good. But that's the entire concept of this shoe. I mean, so right out of the gate, just the, the fabric and the suede used on here are crazy soft. Again, this is back-to-back -back amazing materials on some dunk. So Concepts used a lot of materials to kind of tell their, their story here uh, on this one. It has a ton of different textures on it that are supposed to mim mimic a mallard duck. The most noticeable, like right out of the gate, is this quarter panel here. Uh, the hairs used, or the fabric used, I mean, it feels like, almost like plastic, but the more you touch it, the more the hairs kind of stand up, if you can see it right there. Hopefully you guys can see that. Um, it's super cool. So that is supposed to mimic the feathers of a duck. 
Uh, and then, of course, we have the iridescent Nike swoosh that wraps all the way around at the back. And it goes from, like, this iridescent blue to this iridescent green on the other side, which is super dope. And then we see that, we see that same iridescent coloring on the tongue. And then at the top of the tongue, probably one of my favorite parts of the shoe, we have a yellow Nike tag, Nike branding, and then it says Nike Duck Pro, right below the Nike branding. On the inside, we have a Concepts logo. Uh, around the toe box, we have this, I don't even know if it's if it's suede uh, material, but it's super soft and it's a little hairier than we would normally see on like a suede and then going back, it's a darker brown, way hairier, like furry, soft though. This material around the ankle collar uh, is supposed to mimic like a down pillow, which is, again, just throwing in more feather, duck, turducken concept at the shoe. Again, you're going to get sick of hearing me say concept, but it's just, it is what it is. And then even on the toe box right here, this is crazy soft material. On the midsole, we have this cream orange coloring all along the entire midsole and then a kind of brighter orange that almost looks like a duck duck bill on the outsole let me get into one of these here because one of my favorite parts of the one my other favorite part a second favorite part of this shoe for me is this inside like pattern material they have used uh looks like wallpaper almost that you'd find in your grandma's bathroom but it's so dope so as you can see it's on the back of the tongue as well and then all along the ankle liner of the shoe and on the insole as well man these are this is what i have loved about sb dunks and loved in the past and hopefully continue to love if they bring them out at this quality. They, they have a concept and an idea, and they just run with it. One of my favorites, hang on. So this is not a Concepts collabs from La Familia Skate Shop, but they just go all out. They went all out with their ideas. I mean, this is obviously the Blue Ox one. I did a video on these before just because I... That's something I love and miss about SB Dunks. Just the entire craziness and wildness that used to come along with them travis you know had a bunch of materials on his that was kind of cool but it's it's not a concept like this like they had when pigs fly the lobster ones and all the packaging they do for those is just insane i i absolutely love it and uh i'm appreciative that they put this much thought into something this wild especially with with this packaging but man, I'm so happy that I got a W on these. Please, let, guys, let me know if you did as well. Uh, if you're going to go for these for the regular box on the 23rd, good luck. Uh, I appreciate you all for watching and uh, on to the next one. Peace.